Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's go over to the next stage. I'm gonna leave the mushroom houses for later just because I haven't been using any items in general. So let's go to the hammer swing caverns. I have no idea what the heck hammer swings are. Or maybe it's, they're, they're like not an enemy in particular, but maybe more like an obstacle. I don't know, maybe these, these giant icicles are hammer swings or, oh no, oh, those are hammer swings. So they actually have a name name. These things here. These were in uh, New Super Mario Bros. Wii. How to get around them. You gotta do stuff like this. They're not that hard. But at the same time, it's a matter of timing. So you gotta be kind of careful with that. Oh, that is gonna... That is gonna pretty much destroy the level. <laughs> because now I have squirrel power on my side. I do like this and then... Oh, I could have chained that for a one-up. And I should also be on the lookout for star coins, if at all possible. Mm, let's carefully glide down here. Good. I have to bridge another gap here, I'm sure. Yep. That's what I thought. And it looks like there is something up there. <laughs> Certainly looks like it. So, oh boy. Hmm. Oh, wait, wait. What am I... I could do this. I completely forgot I have that glide. Derp! <laughs> Alright. Now I'm... There's probably something in there. Oh. I'm gonna kick you off before you respawn on me. Wait, what? Or does that just keep respawning those enemies? Unless I'm missing something up there. Hold on. What's, what's the point of that pipe? I see that there's coins down there, but why would I want to get those coins. Give me a good reason why I'd want those coins. <laughs> they seem a little risky to get compared to uh, what they're worth. Yeah, maybe maybe that pipe does just respawn enemies or maybe it's just there for design. I don't know. Anyway, carefully get past the- Oh god, you're the folly kind. <laughs> of course you're the folly kind. Why wouldn't you be? Oh, these are off offset in timing. Hmm. Mm, so I just gotta delay my jump a little. There we go. Oh, and this... These are even, um... Moving on a track. Oh, jeez. Well, that wasn't too bad for a first try. I just must get the hang of them. They're, they're a lot... Stickier than they look in appearance, so to speak. Like, you don't slide off them despite them being at a high angle. I mean, you do eventually slide once they get too, too, too way too steep of an, ang of an angle, but they are not really that big of a deal overall in terms of slipperiness, despite this being an ice level. <laughs> That's more like an ice cave level, but still, it's an ice level. Mm -hmm. See what I mean? It's really easy. I know where the first coin is, and I know where I need to be, so I can pretty much just avoid everything. Although, you know what, I'm going to try the one-up chance here just for the fun of it. Why not? Chance time! <laughs> so if I throw it here, it should chain kill for a one-up. Yep, that's what I thought. Voila. Run here, just get on that ahead of time because it's a little bit easier. Uh, well, I was hoping to trigger that, but I suppose it's a non issue because I have my squirrel powers. Never underestimate the power of a squirrel. Ever. <laughs> uh, those, those icicles there, they are a pain. <laughs> Well, maybe not that big of a pain if you rush through it. Okay, now for this. I must trigger the icicles to fall while surviving. Preferably. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna... Wait, wait, what? Hold on a sec. That definitely has something, you know that. But how do you... Am I actually supposed to squirrel glide then? No! Oh! Jump! Jump! 
I can do that kind of infinitely, but it doesn't help me get in the pipe or recover. Okay. Well, that's probably where the second coin is, and I bet... I bet you that the pipe actually takes you back to where that other green pipe is that I kept trying to go into. Like, it's a, it's a double challenge of sorts, like it would force you to redo some of the stuff that you already did. That's just a guess that I have, though, I don't know for sure. I guess we will find out when we get there. But I know for sure that I, that I now need squirrel power. So I cannot skimp getting the acorn. And that also means I can't afford to take a hit. <laughs> Which could be a problem. Yeah, hopefully, I only need it for that second coin, then I'll just be able to do basic platforming for the rest of it. Platforming 101. Oop. Gotta love that glide. <laughs> Alright, so that's one. And you are not really in the way that badly. Mm, yeah, rushing is definitely the way to go on that. It's much, much more consi consistent, excuse me. Blah. Just let that swing while I get the icicles off. And here we go. No, I did it too early again. What's wrong with me? <laughs> I need to do it closer to the pipe, and when I'm about to go into the abyss... Concentrate... Yes! That's how you want to do it. Now, what's in here? It better be something important. Um, oh no. It's a piece switch run with something that will slow you down. But, first things first, I gotta be down here, that's for sure. So I'm guessing I gotta do that. Run here. Get on this, and go in. That wasn't bad at all. Now, where does this pipe take you? Is it back to where... No, it's past those buzzy beetles. Hopefully I didn't miss a coin back there. I'm gonna trust that I didn't. So I guess that other pipe was just there for design? Maybe? Anyway, <laughs> let's get this moving. And grooving. I'm not gonna hit that... Um, green ring because it's just gonna distract me and I don't really need the power-up that comes from it now I'm, I'm more focused on keeping my squirrel powers here I don't know what this does it just makes coins appear I guess like this is actually pretty distracting oh no 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 oh, I hope I didn't need that for no I didn't need it okay so I can just wall kick off that if need be, and this is probably the end of the stage, yes! At least I hope it's the end of the stage. Oh, it's not the end of the stage. At least not yet, but I've done a bunch of these already, so it's no big deal, really. Alright. Huh, how do you get that goal? There Maybe there's a secret block somewhere around there? I mean, how do you get the one up on the goal, excuse me? Another one goes down the drain. Another path opens up to the mushroom house. So I guess each mushroom house has its own path to get to there. Splinning! Splinning! Spinning platforms of doom! Ooh, we've got the watercolor background and it's spooky town! Hmm. Do I have to like ride these things the whole way through? That'd be pretty interesting. I guess I do. Well, this is pretty much what I was doing in the last level, except it's less tight. At least it feels less tight. There might be more to it, but considering that this has got the ghost level music, you can't trust the ghost level. <laughs> For all I know, there might be something hidden within that ceiling. Mm. 
<laughs> I don't know, I'm just kind of being weird here. I'm gonna check the pipes just to be sure. I'm glad they brought back this background, that was very beautiful. And do I want to go down underneath there? I do. So, I'll take advantage of my squirrel powers. Wait, actually, I'm gonna stop moving here for a sec. I need to flip around to the other side, because I'm not sure how my jump works, <laughs> to be honest. Low jump it. Glide. Oh no, I lost it. Hopefully I'll get a replacement later, but that's the first star coin, I guess. Hmm. Yep, really happy they brought back this art style. And it looks like they want me to wall kick past that piranha plant up ahead. Or I can glide past it. <laughs> That'll work just as well. So it looks like I did get another one. Please tell me. But I will not have to deal with those boo rings as I'm riding on this thing. I will have to deal with them. Oh my god. Okay, uh, how do I get that? I don't know, like that, I guess. <laughs> um, um, giant boo ring, you are scaring me. Uh, uh oh. That's probably a. Probably a vine. <clears throat> I wouldn't put it past them. So what if I get on there and wait for the gap? That was terrible waiting. <gasps> oh god! That is not a vine, and that was not worth it. That, however, is a vine, and this is a pipe. I am talking about the obvious here. Oh, uh, uh oh. What does this do? Oh, I see. This isn't bad at all, actually. <gasps> I can't wall kick when I'm grabbing like that? Why? <laughs> at least it felt like I couldn't wall kick when I was grabbing onto that. So that might actually be more of an issue than I thought. But at least I know that I won't have to do something insane to get to any vine like I thought I did before. <sighs> uh, although... I might want the spoils in that box, because it's probably an acorn. Well, it's a mushroom corn. <laughs> yep, that's what I thought. Because I, I need one for the uh, first star coin here. I'm just going to skip that. And then, low jump, glide. There we go, that's much better. Even after all this time, I still don't feel I have... The squirrel suit mastered. It's probably because I haven't. It's not like it's a game that I've played through many, many times over and whatnot. You get what I mean? Alright, glide. See, there's like. See that you you still fall in the middle of your guide glide as you're falling. I mean, if you're falling down like that, but then it, it slows down. That I think that slowdown is what kind of throws me off a little bit. Alright. Good start on this one, even though it's spinning a lot faster than any other one. At least I know that I don't need to worry about going underneath it this time. And I can just skip right past it now. Good. Now I know there is this down here. Okay, you can wall kick off that. I thought so, but it just felt like I couldn't there for a second. Alright, so get on here. You just wall kick like this, and then you should be able to get through it like that. It's Really, really easy to do. You even slide and grip on... No, no, wait, wait, wait. My god. <laughs> oh, I'm concentrating hard here, by the way. So, excuse the quietness there. Hey, I got all three star coins. That's nice. And... Oh, my god. <laughs> They are not going down without a fight, that's for sure. Wait, actually this one isn't that bad. I can jump from one large flat end to the other based on the timing of this one spinning. I'm just gonna skip that and get to the end. <laughs> yeah! And that's all I think I'm gonna be doing in this part. Oh, and I just noticed that there was uh, watercolor Bowser Jr. there in the background. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Woo!